So, my Muay Thai, sitting here with Mr. Steve Wakeling. I'm at the uh, Warriors show in um, Crawley and uh, ran into Steve and thought it would be a great time to sit down, have a quick chat. So, Steve, uh, what's up, man? You all right? Yeah, I'm good, thanks. Yeah. Just um, took some fighters out to fight, so I lost my voice a little bit. Yeah, no. Um, you're looking fucking massive, dude. Like, you, are you lifting? What's going on? Um, I'm doing a lot of strength, strength training as I have had no fight sort of programs. Um, and there's because um, you fight 72, 76, 76, 76, 77 now. What are you walking around at now, though? Um, about 90, nice. 91, 92. Nice, nice, nice. So, um, most of the guys on my Muay Thai know you, um, definitely from your last title bout. Congrats on that. Thank you. Um, most people, though, don't realize that you've been in the game for shit since how old were you? Uh, my first fight was when I was 16, so it's about 12, 12 years ago. Yeah, and um, strange little bit of connection. It turns out when you you went to Fairtex in Pattaya. It was uh, Bangli. Bang Bangli. Yeah. How old were you then? Um, just turned 19. 19. 19 yes. My understanding was uh, my ex trainer Ning Siam was supposed to sort of look after you. Yeah, he was the first Thai trainer I've um, had in, in when I went to Thailand and he was the first one to train me. Yeah, so you guys still keep in touch? or? Yeah, I still teach with him on Facebook and um, keep in touch with him that way. Yeah, no, he's doing quite well. Uh, he, uh, he was supposed to fight um, last month, but basically his guy, uh, I don't know what happened either, he didn't make weight or something, but he didn't end up fighting, went all the way down to LA and right. got nothing. So, last time I saw you fight was back in Pattaya. Yeah. And so what do you got? You got anything cooking? Any any up, upcoming fights or? Nothing at the moment. I'm just sort of still training, keeping fit, and then anything that comes up, I'll be ready to sort of fight within like sort of three months, two three months. Yeah. You're um obviously you're are you your dad's the head trainer at Scorpions, yes, yes. and you and your brother basically help out with the training. Yes, that's right. So, so you guys got a bunch of up and coming fighters, I saw. Yes, yeah, we've got a few fighters coming through. So, I mean, do you want to, I mean, is that the goal? Is that, you're going to take over? You want to start your own gym? You want to keep no, fighting? No, I'm going to stay at that gym. I'll, um, I'll take over, um, obviously. <laughs> when, help, help when your dad is damn good and ready. Yeah. Exactly. It's not, not yet. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, that's cool. Um, well, look. I'm I'm anxious to get you to, to see you back in action. Um, as with all the my Muay Thai guys, they definitely want to see you back out there mixing it up. Yeah, I'd love to fight. Um, so. Hopefully, you get some uh, some action out in the states or here. Or, I mean, who's there left to fight? You've I mean, you have the belt. Yeah. Um, what what other belts do you have, by the way? I've held the other WBC at 72 yep. um, against John Wayne Parr. Yep. Um, I hear he's not retiring anymore, so no, they say. No, he's supposed to be carried on, so yeah. maybe there will be... Maybe maybe there's a little a little rematch. Yes, maybe, yes. Maybe you want to call him out now? <laughs> Don't call anyone out. I just try to just fight him put in front of me. No, I'm, not, I'm, yeah. I'm trying not to stir too much shit. But anyway, look, um, it was great. Thanks for taking the time out. Um, it was great seeing you, and uh, hopefully we'll see you back in the ring uh, soon. Okay, thank you very All much. All right, thanks, mate.